Clinical Pearls, brought to you by Medicom Oncology. Hi, my name is Dr. Allison Moskowitz, and for the next few minutes, I'm going to be talking about the, how the side effect profile of brentuximab vidotin differs from the traditional monoclonal antibodies. Brentuximab vidotin is an antibody drug conjugate with a monoclonal antibody against CD30 that is conjugated to a chemotherapy agent called MMAE. MMAE is a microtubular inhibitor. And so similar to other agents that affect microtubulars, one of the side effects of this agent is neuropathy, and that is uh, a common side effect that we see with brentuximab. Brentuximab can also be uh, occasionally associated with neutropenia. Uh, in contrast, the standard monoclonal, mono, uh, the monoclonal antibodies are, uh, have, different side of, have a different side effect profile, uh, particularly because they're not conjugated to a chemotherapy agent. So, for example, with rituximab, one of the most common side effects that we see with rituximab are infusion-related reactions, and as a result, patients are always, pre, always receive pre-medications prior to treatment with rituximab. In contrast with brentuximab, pre-treatment with uh, pre-medications prior to treatment is not necessary unless the patient has had a prior infusion-related reaction. Likewise, some of the other side effects that are related to brentuximab, which are primarily due to the fact that it's conjugated to a, a chemotherapy agent, such as constipation or fatigue, are less commonly seen with uh, a monoclonal antibody, such as rituximab. Thank you for your attention. Don't forget to subscribe to the Medicom Oncology podcast channel for more clinical pearls. And be sure to visit managinghodgkinslymphoma.com for more educational resources.